Hey, what's up guys? I'm Anush Patel from AndroidRoots.com. We're going to go ahead and take a look at GoldenEye RAM for the Galaxy S4 GT and a 505, AT&T, T-Mobile, and Canadian variants. I'll leave a link down below where you can go ahead and download this ROM if you want to go ahead and get it on your very own Galaxy S4. Um, so this is very cool as it is running on TouchWiz with Android 4.4.2 KitKat, the latest version of Android. Um, so that's one of the coolest features right there. Um, so as you can see, we got Android 4.4.2 and boom, there is a little K right there. Um, you can go ahead and play with it, and then you got the Android, Android 4.4.2 at the bottom. So that's really, really nice right there. Um, so I gotta say, I really like that um, right there. Also, it's it has app to SD cards, so I know a lot of other ROMs, especially OSP ROMs, they will never have this. Uh, but with uh, Samsung, um, you have an option to go ahead and change, uh, to actually move all your internal applications to your SD card to save uh, storage. Um, so for my case, I don't have an application installed, you know, from one from the Play Store. Um, so I'll just show this one, for example. Um, so within Application uh, Manager, within Settings, you have an option for Move to SD Card. So let's say, for example, you had Asphalt 8 or something like that. You can go and tap on Move to SD Card, and you can move all the Asphalt 8 uh, data all to your external SD card so you can save a lot of internal storage for more important information or you know Samsung software <laughs> since they keep adding more and more uh, software onto the Samsung devices um, so that can really help you out um, on top of that you also have extended reboot menu right here um, so you have a uh, data right there airplane um, you also have restart and within restart you have hot hot boot download and recovery right there um, so that's also another nice add-on and since this is on Android 4.4.2 um, Samsung Knox which was originally by stock on here um, it was removed so there's two benefits one we don't need that for us more technical people and second of all it saves you a lot more uh, uh, storage space since that software is pretty darn big um, also the boot sound is removed so if you like rebooting your uh, phone <laughs> when it's silent and you don't want it to be noisy it's that's also a nice option um, on top of that you also have all the Google applications except the necessary Everyone's basically removed. Um, so, like for example, Google Plus is removed. Um, Google Hangouts isn't here. Um, so, if you don't want to get those applications, you just head down to the Play Store and grab them. Uh, but for the most part, you only have the bare essentials for the Google applications. Uh, but you still get those Samsung applications like S Voice, S Translator, Planner, Memo, and even Watch On is included at the bottom. Uh, right there, so you still have those options if you do use them. Um, I rarely use them, even watch, and I rarely use that now. Um, even though I, it's useful, <laughs> I just use the remotes because it's a lot easier to access. Um, it's right by my side instead of actually turning on my device. <laughs> I don't know if I'm more lazier or more efficient in that way. Um, it is also, of course, simple, uh, more simple as you can see. It's very a much more clean look even though you still got a green and all that all the crazy Samsung notifications that you usually see at the notifications right here are pretty much removed you know you usually have all those pop-ups coming up and all that um, so all that is removed um, there is absolutely no lag with this ROM so that is really nice even though with this, with all these Samsung widgets right here um, even the first startup I did not experience any lag so that's really a good sign um, about this ROM and how well it'll perform a uh, daily basis and just with gaming as well and one last final thing is you also have in-call recording. So if you make a phone call, you can actually go ahead and record that phone call for you know later purposes, maybe uh, you know a, a situation or something like that. You have the option to record it, so that's really nice too. Um, so that is it, guys. That is a golden eye ROM for the Galaxy S4 GT on a 505 AT&T T-Mobile and Canadian variants running on Android 4.4.2 TouchWiz KitKat ROM. Uh, that's probably the best part. It's running on uh, KitKat with a TouchWiz ROM right there. Um, if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to uh, like and subscribe to this video in the bottom left-hand corner. Comment down below. Link in the video description will bring you to my website where you can go ahead and download golden eye ROM for the Galaxy S4. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Twitter, Facebook, and Google+, which is also located down below. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.